AV nodal block. Three types of the AV nodal blocks. The first degree, second degree and a third degree block. In first degree block there is prolonged PR interval. See that P and R interval is prolonged. The rhythm is regular and QRS is usually normal. Is one more. That's a prolonged PR interval. In the first degree block there is no QRS drop. Second degree block if the QRS is wide then it means it's a distal block and if the QRS is narrow then it's a proximal block that is in the AV node or in the bundle and the rate is fast. The heart rate is fast in case of a narrow QRS. So what is the site of block in a first degree block? The site of block is usually in the AV node but it may also occur in atria, bundle of his and the Purkinje tissues. In a second degree block, not all impulses reach the ventricles. Therefore, there is a 2 is to 1 or a 3 is to 1 block. There are two types of the second degree block. Mobitz type 1 or Wenkebex and a Mobitz type 2 block. What's the difference between Mobitz type 1 and Mobitz type 2? In Mobitz type 1, there is a progressively increasing PR interval. See here, this compared to this one, this increasing PR interval, and then there is a drop beat. There is one P, and there is QRS missing. So, once the QRS is missing, the rate is irregular compared to the type 1 block where the rate was regular and QRS was present. Here, the QRS is missing, and the rate is irregular. And this is worsened by the carotid sinus massage, but it responds to atropine. This is also Mobitz type 1. Here is the missing QRS, and this is progressively increasing PR interval here. These are the ECGs for the type 1. This ECG shows a second degree heart block, Mobitz type 1, with progressively increasing PR interval. But then there is a QRS missing as well as a P wave is missing. So this is an example in second degree block where the P wave is also missing along with a QRS complex. Then in type 2, second degree hard block, there is a fixed PR interval with a sudden drop of QRS. So this is the difference between type 1 and type 2. Here it is. The PR interval is prolonged but fixed. And then there is a missed QRS. Atrial rate is regular and the ventricular rate is irregular because the QRS is missing. So the ventricular rate is irregular. This is another second degree block. Type 2. Fixed PR interval and a sudden drop of the QRS. In Mobitz type 2 block, the QRS is abnormal and it occurs in distal or infra his bundle conduction system and is often associated with a bundle branch block. Duration of the QRS complex helps to determine the level of the block because it's a wide in the distal block. Treatment of the block. Physiological treatment. What's the physiological? Vagal stimulation and carotid sinus massage. Where does it act? It slows the conduction in the AV node but has less effect on infranodal tissues. Number two, the drugs atropine and isoproterenol and also the exercise. They improve the conduction through the AV node but impairs the conduction through the infranodal tissue. So vagal stimulation, carotid massage, atropine, isoproterenol and exercise, all of them act on the AV node. Vagal stimulation and carotid massage slow the conduction at the AV node whereas atropine isoprotonol and exercise increase the conduction through the AV node but all of these vagal stimulation carotid massage atropine isoprotonol and exercise have very little or no effect on conduction through the infranodal tissues what is the effect of exercise on a block in relation to the QRS complex with a narrow QRS complex in congenital heart blocks exercise increases the heart rate whereas with a wide QRS complex in acquired heart blocks exercise does not increase the heart rate so with narrow congenital QRS with congenital heart exercise increase the heart rate 
and with void QRS in acquired condition, exercise does not increase the heart rate. Then a third degree heart block, also known as stroke Adams attack, atria and ventricle they beat of their own. So there is extreme dizziness, hypertension and syncope and altered mental status. This usually occurs in septal MI or when there is damage to the bundle of his and the treatment is permanent pacemaker. Here is the third degree heart block, see the atria ventricle beating of their own and then there is a white cure is complex the heart rate is slow this is third degree heart block you can see all these ecgs 